Well, go back to Cyberpunk, everybody. We are at Embers, as you can see right there. Mm. And these fine Japanese gentlemen know I'm armed. You've reached a point of no return. When you enter the restaurant, you'll be locked out of all unfinished side jobs and other activities like gigs until all your main jobs are complete. <gasps> no. No, how dare you. Aw, oh, man. I want to do all these. I want to fight in the ring. I guess we... Well, no, I guess we're not. We're, we're just going. This is it. Welcome to the end, folks. The stakes are high. This is it. God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. I know. I'll be careful. Not exactly one of your strong suits. Listen, first sign of trouble, we Delta. I can't. The, the engram's taken to... over. She's waiting she for me. She emptied the place. Shit. And our relic is creeping set right now. Oh, hello. Bro. What do we got cool clothes like that? You have come. Hey, Hanako. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobud killed your father. No? I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate. Inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Mm. Power. Family. Our family. I was to be its heart. To uphold life. Ensure continuity. Stability. Never to oppose it. Huh. Guess your Nobu's instructions were a little different? Yorinobu raised his hand against our father. But he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm-hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard, it'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yurinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Seem on edge? Something got you spooked? I... don't know. Three times now that A.B. has flown by. Think someone might have tailed you? We must not get distracted. Did you bring Soul Killer? Take me for a fool. Think I'd fall for that? 
Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Minen, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. <laughs> Look at the mono wire. <laughs> hmm. He's dangerous. Hmm. Just say it. Be easier that way. I want him punished. Still vague. You want him dead. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama, soro-soro gojitaku ni omodori itaraite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you what? will testify against my brother. <laughs> testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight <laughs> with you. Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Uh... Let's assume it works. Then what? You take the Arasaka throne? Where would you get that idea? Figured it as a given. Besides, Takamura said you were supposed to step in for Yorinobu here in Night City. Everyone must know their place, V. That is a fact my brother has never understood. I know my place. And I have no wish to change it. No wish to? Or no permission? You being a woman. I decide my own fate. As should you. So... Hmm. Want me to throw Yorinobu under the bus in front of our Saka top brass? Call me crazy, but that sounds like fucking suicide. This I know. And that is why we will take all the necessary precautions. Like... such as... You will see. Hmm. <laughs> Offer's intriguing. Need to think about it. Naturally. But think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. Let's fly the fuck out of here. V? Do you feel all right? Huh? You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. No worries about that. You could use some air right now. <laughs> Wait a second. I forgot. I wasn't in the right clothes. Could look professional. <coughs> oh, everything's bad. Can't move. Leave the restaurant. Alright, Relic. Let's go to the street. I warned you. What, what are you doing? 
Shit, we could be hours from it now, V. And you can't stand on your own two feet. Well, I'm good to go. Buddy listens to me. Um... See what I'm getting at? Of course I can see. Want me to hand over the keys? I want to save your life. Pop some pseudo endotrizine, scooch, and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Makoshi. Uh huh. How exactly? Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago. But now, I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Makoshi. It's our only chance. What about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen up, V. Those guys are trailer tuggers. An assault on our Asaka is just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. And you... tried it with pros. Didn't end any fucking better. You don't want those people involved. Their lives on the line. Possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Hanako's offers on the table. I'm sorry. Whose? Oh, God, the crap. She actually has power. Could be our ticket. Yeah, one-way ticket to the city morgue. That suck a cunt scrambled your circuits. Rogue and I will handle this, just like we used to. You dickhead. What's your scheme? This is my body. I make the Not most. this time. <laughs> Johnny! Jesus, look at you. Can't even. Great, you checking out again? Oh no. What am I. <laughs> no, it's not what you think. Not yet, anyway. Easy there. Don't move just yet. Victor. Vic. You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Uh. Almost done stabilizing the biochip. No, feels like... Someone's using your head as a knife block? How... How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you be treated immediately. Dalamint was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh... I wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up, carefully. I'll try. Think I'm getting some feeling back. Ah. Sit slowly. Another victory for the history books. Hmm. If you got something to say, Vic, just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. 
This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Take matters into my own hands? The fuck you think I've been doing? Well, whatever it is, it keeps landing you on my table. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah? What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrizin there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. <sighs> or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you, and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine, Rogue, Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Give it a fucking rest, Johnny. It's my decision. And I gotta think about it. Need to stretch, stretch your noodle? noodle. Fine. Fine. Just not, Just not in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Uh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Thank you enough for all you've done, Vic. Only wish I could have done more. Go on now. I want to close up. Take the meds and do what you gotta do, V. Thanks, Vic. I will. And you hang in there, too. Good luck, kid. Wow. Hey, V, I heard. Well... Your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy. For either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. We are in a state right now. Top floor. He had the same glum face. Who, oh, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumbas on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm-hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but... He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Where's here? Ah, oh, that's more like it. Air. See that? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Be alone with my thoughts. You're on unachievable these days. So what? What did Jackie decide up here? 
Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Judy. Yeah. Even I've grown to like her. She ought to know that. Hey, Judy. Oh, hey, V. What's cracking? Time we, uh, went swimming. Hmm? A lot of fun, wasn't it? What you said then, about what you sensed in me. Death. High time I faced it. Can't be sure it'll work, but I gotta try. Listen, whatever it is you're gonna try, just be careful, okay? I'm here waiting. Thanks. Do my best. <sighs> okay. Was good you called. Wish I'd had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think, it all started in a fucking landfill. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Oh, man. I think we do Pan Am. Rogus Street. Pan Am is... thing. That's corporate. <sighs> but Johnny's super powerful. I think we ask Pan Am. The Aldecados went through so many things. What a decision. But we're going straight. You know what? We're going straight. Think you ought to go with Rogue. Two of you together got the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. You're up, Johnny. I trust you. He hasn't failed us yet. Take the wheel. Just go easy on us, yeah? Thanks, V. I'll get us through this. You'll see. Better. See you on the other side. That's, That's right. Even if I gotta burn this whole fucking city down. Hold on a second. First off. Sweet armor. Sweet jumpsuit. Sweet armor. Um, time to go military. We're gonna break some stuff. Look who we have here. Shut up. Who the bell tolls? What? The way they moved, they behaved. Hey there, V. Like Drop in for one last drink before turning in. Ugh, horse shit. Calling me a liar? I'm saying it was hotter than. I'm looking for Rogue. Big booth over there, but you probably don't want to disturb her now. No, I think I do. Wait, no, I'm serious. She'll kick you in the can. That what you think? Then just watch and learn. Oh, I'll watch, but I doubt I'll be the one to get a lesson.
This is heavy right now. I'll put it to you this way, Wakaka. How are you doing? Don't get in my way. Wakaka. You're running your little operation only because I have allowed it. And I can change my mind whenever I want. Hang on, give me a sec. V. V's taking a break. It's, it's me. me. We'll talk soon, Wakako. What do you want, Johnny? Jesus, who died? Not happy to see me? Frankly, I'm not sure. Why? We had fun at the movies, didn't we? We're not at the movies anymore. Plus, got a good idea why you're here. You want something. And that's always a bad sign. Pretty tight setup you got, Rogue. Queen of Night City. Couldn't have been easy to achieve all this. So many others failed. The hell's that supposed to mean? Just thinking back. You miss the old times at all, Rogue? Fine with where they are, fine with where I am. I can see that. Shame no one else from the Atlantis had the same luck. Hey, everybody! We're closed! Oh, what gives? Now. We ain't finished yet! Oh, yes, you is! Shish, what's the matter? Nothing. Your shift's done. You're heading home to kick your feet up. Okay. Guess I'ma go back to work. We'll have the whole place to ourselves? Hmm. VIP treatment. Now talk. Just what the hell are you insinuating? That my, my bottle, bottle behind the bar? Yep, been waiting there. Just, I never knew what the fuck for. But I'm starting to get some good ideas about how I might use it. Chose a cozy life for yourself. I'm just curious what it cost you. We all pay a price for the choices we make. I'm no exception. That what you tell yourself when you're cashing corp checks? That's what I tell myself when I stand over the graves of the crew from the Atlantis. It's what I tell myself when I look at you now. Well, oh, hey. The past is the past. That's right. But that's not why you're here. You want to drag me into something again, and this chatter is just a prelude. This body... I'm trying to... I... No. Fuck! V's dying, and I'm the fucking cancer killing her. But the process can be stopped. I just no, have to... No, Johnny. Don't start. Don't tell yourself you're out to help someone. It's only ever about you, so you can feel better. You sure about that? Yeah. Same as it was with Alt. Wasn't even about guilt, that. Just some fucking sense of personal discomfort. Now fuck oh. off, princess. I'm running out of time, Rogue. When that fucking clock strikes 12, Johnny will disappear and V will go with him. Need to get myself out of her head before that happens. We managed to contact all. She agreed to help. But? Only one place we can do it. The data fort. Mikoshi. And the only access point we got a chance of reaching is tucked snugly under Saka Tower. Arasaka? Again? Should have seen that coming. Only an idiot does the same thing over and over, while expecting things to work out differently. You even have a plan for this? We need bodies. You know the kind. And we need gear. Best money can buy. And some luck. Hopefully a little fucking luck. Did you say we? Willing to miss out on this?
So what? I dust off and load up my tsunami? Rejoin your crusade against Arasaka? Bingo. When? Dunno. Mm -hmm. Now? Hmm. And what makes you think I'd agree? Cause I think you know you owe me one. Me and everybody else you buried while you climbed to the top. Shit. Knew this would happen one day. That one night, by some fucking miracle, you'd waltz in here and tear everything down. Some things never change. And us? Have we changed? I don't know. Well, what do you say we go find out? Will you lend me a hand? Shut the fuck up, Johnny. Just... stop talking. Whoa. The stakes are high. Why... are you laying down? Why can't we hear anything? Christ, Christ. <laughs> every time, every time, never have I seen one not drunk as a pig sleep over 20 hours. Next, Next time, time you're, you're losing teeth, think so. I would like to see you try, but the boss would not be happy when I break your bones. Mean rogue, there's only one boss. Let's go. The boss awaits. Alright, well, if I can save, that's going to do it for this episode. But I can't, so continue we go. I wonder why we can't save here. Don't matter if it takes some junk. So we're going to be looking for upgrades. We're in after afterlife. All right. See you two said your hellos. Excellent. Rogue, what's this specimen doing here? He's our pilot and our ride to Corpo Plaza today. Rogue. You were the best. I'm excited. Of course I am. Your sorry ass wouldn't be here otherwise. Gears over there. Help yourself. Yes, Don't gear. mind if I do. Gear up. Take all the ammo. Uh, we'll take pistol. Grab sure. some gear, Johnny. Don't forget. Power assault rifle. Lots of guns. Oh, sword. Uh, yes. Lexington. Retro thrusters. What are these? Retro thrusters. Anti-grabs. We're gonna fly. Strap them to your legs, and you can jump from damn near any height. Armored armor. Christ, Johnny, I'm not your fucking babysitter. Never mind. Got it. Okay, now. Gonna tell me what the plan is. Yep. Jack in the shard. Jack in the shard. Wait a second. Uh, we got... 136 armor. It's really crappy. Not better than this, so we'll keep that on. Shoes, naturally... Oh, 69 armor. They actually are better. So that's actually good. Nice. Um, yeah, okay, that's that. A uh, gun. I got a shotgun. 538. The 
this tactician gun. Not better than what we have. It's power shotgun does thermal damage. Burn chance. But it's got, look at all those mod slots. So if this is going to be as good as it gets, then... That's what we're going to do. Sniper rifle... I'm going to assault rifle instead of sniper, but I think the sniper will be better for us. Although I can put a ton of mods on this thing. That sniper's really good though for the long range. And then here's our big boom boom. Yep, we are good to go. Oh, now can I save? Before the shard? No? Take the shard. Let's see what's going on. Targets the Makoshi access point in Arasaka Tower. Need to reach the lab floor. Hold it just long enough to do what we need to do, then get out alive. Arasaka Tower's a fortress, the most secure building in Night City. Walking in through the front door just ain't an option. So, we'll get in through a window of our own making. Specifically, we fly in on a Militech Strix tactical bomber. First, we rain fire on the building's air defenses from a high altitude. Then we breach a wall on the 76th floor, jump from the AV, and survive the landing thanks to our anti-grabs. That's right. We'll land smack in the middle of a tropical rainforest. Contrary to popular opinion, Arasaka has panache at times. We cut our way through the jungle to a shaft located on the tower's vertical axis. The shaft runs the height of the building, we use our retro thrusts again. Reach the bottom floor quickly. We'll surprise the socks off security. They'll be in disarray. Resistance should be minimal. We hit the lab floor running, reach the access point. The rest will be in your hands. I'll hold for applause. As I said, there's only one boss, one queen. Didn't say you had a bomber. We all have our secrets. Guess nowadays the slick red Mezutani just doesn't cut it. How'd you get that? I'm the best fixer in town, idiot. Enough said. Now focus on the plan. Saying we're gonna rain fire on these assholes. Seriously? I've waited too long for this. Don't bust out of your pants just yet. If we want to survive, we got to do a lot more. Here comes the tricky bit. We're going to knock a Jerujan 0401 comsat off its orbit. A blood clot satellite. We going to make history friends. That'll freeze comms in NC, NorCal, and SoCal. Should buy us three or four hours. No coordination, no support, complete chaos. Mean to tell me that apart from that fucking bomber, you have a weaponized space shuttle? Got a certain acquaintance at Orbital Air. Mystery benefactor? Highly positioned informant. I'll pay him enough to give us access to the Jerujan. The rest will be up to our old Netrunner friend. You mean Alt? Only one I know who can rip an Arasaka satellite out of the sky. Supposed to talk to Alt anyway. I'll convince her. Don't fuck this up, Johnny. It's the one thing I can't do. For Said I'd do it, and I will. So summing up, we fly to Arasaka Tower unnoticed and say hello with a welcome basket of missiles. Exactly. Then we jump in, find the building's vertical axis, and work our way down. To the Makoshi access point. Yep. What'd you think? Just one problem. There's no coming back from this. You'll burn bridges. To ash and dust. All Arasaka's gonna be gunning for you. Yeah. Probably Orbital Air will too. But as I see it, they braided this whip that's gonna sting them. So? What do you think? Plan's got more gaping holes than a kabuki dollhouse. 
But fuck it, it's gotta work. It won't be the stupidest stunt we've ever pulled. Rogue? What? Just thank you. Thank me later. There's still the matter of old. Do you know how to move around cyberspace? Well, V got some practice under her belt. Sure, I'll manage. Head out back. Nix will show you the ropes. Go to the and you, Wayland, heat up the Strix. We'll be with you soon. Mm -hmm. How long you gonna be? Might I have time for a nap? <laughs> Now can I save? I think I can. Which means that's it for this episode. I'll see you in the next one. We're going to go net running and diving and stuff. Bye.